In an historic and downright shocking vote of 52 to 48 percent, the United Kingdom will be leaving the European Union. Now, prior to the vote, economists had predicted that this could do substantial damage to the British economy, uh, and it seems as though that is the case. So the value of the British pound dropped by over 8 percent, which brings it to its lowest level since 1985. And also there's talks about reunification between Ireland and North Ireland. Uh, there is now talks about Scotland wanting to leave the UK because they voted to remain in the EU and they want to be a member of the EU. So now there may be another independence vote and also their prime minister, David Cameron, has resigned. Now, stocks are also expected to plummet, and some economists contend that it could actually cost 100 million pounds and nearly 950,000 jobs. Now, when you compare that to Britain's yearly membership fee to the EU, which is 17.8 billion pounds, uh, although they actually only pay about 12.9 billion because of rebates that they get, uh, not to mention the grants and the subsidies that they get just for being a member of the EU, well, in actuality, it seems like a terrible decision because they will be losing more than they would be paying into the EU, not to mention... You're part of the EU. There are benefits entailed with that. Now, also, uh, France has surpassed Britain as the fifth largest economy in the world since they voted to leave. Uh, so when it comes to the consequences, already we're seeing a ton of it unfold. And uh, one of the biggest things that we don't know what will happen is how this will impact the EU fully. We know that uh, Great Britain will be losing their voting bloc in the European Parliament, so they won't get representation there. Uh, and now they were the second largest economy in the EU after Germany. And now this, it just has everything up in the air and it's really scary watching it unfold. I wish I could say, you know, as a political scientist, I could sit back and enjoy it because it's not happening here. But this will certainly have consequences for the U.S. as well. Now, the New York Times explains that for the European Union, the result is a disaster, raising questions about the direction, cohesion and future of the bloc built on liberal values and shared sovereignty that represents with NATO a vital component of Europe's post-war structure. The loss of Britain is an enormous blow to the credibility of a bloc already under pressure from slow growth, high unemployment and migrant crisis, Greece's debt woes, and the conflict in Ukraine, the main impact will be massive disorder in the EU system for the next two years, said Thierry de Montbriol, founder and executive chairman of the French Institute of International Relations. There will be huge political transition costs on how to solve the British exit and the risk of a domino effect or bank run from other countries that think of leaving. Because of this vote, you're going to see a lot of societal divisions. Many of the people I know from the UK are really worried about uh, political polarization between the far left and the far right. Uh, and they have good reason to uh, be worried about that. Because now, who knows what's going to happen? Will the EU last? Because, I mean, for me, I've taken a class in the EU before, and the biggest question that I had, even after taking the class, was how the hell does this work? How do all of these countries stay together? And now, it looks as though what was already a fragile union, arguably, is even more fragile. Uh, what's going to happen to the UK? I mean, will Northern Ireland leave? Will Scotland leave? There's so many unanswered questions that we won't know, and it's all going to unfold over the next couple of years. And it's absolutely scary and shocking. And for me, I, I couldn't stop thinking about this. I didn't suspect that this would actually happen. And now, you know, the reverberations of this will be felt around the world. So in conclusion, this is incredibly shocking and will certainly be interesting to watch.